In the past couple of centuries, many of the labors which had to be done by humans are now done by machines. People used to dig the ground with shovels, now bulldozers dig the ground for us. Each book had to be written in its entirety by hand. Now they are published in the thousands by printing machines, and complex mathematical problems used to take hours to solve. But today, computers solve them within seconds. So how long would it be before all labor is automated and human work becomes redundant? Automation is the automatically controlled operation of an apparatus, process or system by mechanical or electronic devices that take the place of human labor. In many fields, machines have managed to perform tasks previously done by humans with higher efficiency, speed and at a lower cost. This has made many labors easier. Work which once took extensive physical labor can now be done from behind the console. While this trend of automation has given many people hope for an easier and more relaxed future, some have fears about what will happen to their jobs in this automated world. So let's see how automation has affected our lives up until this point in history. There was a time in the past when virtually all labor was done with manual human effort. But this changed when the first form of automation came about in the form of beasts of burden. But these animals mostly did not change the way humans worked. Rather, it helped them increase the scale of their work. A farmer could farm a much larger piece of land with an ox. A trader could transport much more goods with camels. And travelers could travel with much more speed using horses. So while some new jobs were created, for the most part, the existing jobs were enhanced or made easier. But things would be much more different when the next wave of automation hit with the invention of the steam engine and the beginning of the industrial age. It was during this era that large-scale automation caused many people to lose their jobs, as they could be done by far fewer people, and some jobs became obsolete altogether. But at the same time, many new jobs were created. Many of the people who had lost their jobs due to automation migrated to these new occupations, while others were unwilling or incapable of doing so. Also, in certain situations, there might not be enough job opportunities for people to migrate to when automation takes over their jobs. All of this could exacerbate unemployment issues, which could in turn lead to a wide range of social and economic problems. However, the general long-term trend of automation is that once a section of labor can be done by machines, there would be more people doing the rest of the labor, which would increase overall production. And this brings us to our next point, the areas of work which machines are taking over. Since the beginning of the Industrial Revolution, machines gradually took over manual labor, but most work which required thinking were still in the realm of humans. The first mental process to be automated was calculation. And as technology progressed, computers became capable of analysis. Eventually, the only area where computers could not enter was creativity. However, in the last few years, this has started to change as well. This song was made by a computer. Artificial intelligences are being taught how to compose songs, write stories, and draw pictures. Although they are not very good at it at the time, but the writing is on the wall. Computers are starting to become creative, and one day they might become even more creative than us. So what will happen when computers could do anything humans can do, and do it even better? What would a world where human labor is unnecessary look like? Find out the answer to this question in the next episode of AI Insight.